Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I will be showing how to update your Microsoft Edge browser. So this process that we're going to be doing today is slightly different from updating other browsers, particularly because Microsoft Edge is built into Windows 10. So if I actually open up Microsoft Edge here, and I go up to the top right, and then I left click on settings, and I scroll down here, I can see under about this app that we are currently on version 20.10240.16384. Now by doing a simple Google search, you can probably figure out what the current version is at the time you're watching this video. For me, I know it is in the 25 range, so I know we're definitely out of date. So in order to update the browser, we're going to have to close out of it. And then just going under the star menu, if we type in update, we want to check for updates. So right now, Windows updates are actually automatically installing, so you should have the updates for the Microsoft Edge browser when you upgrade your computer. Microsoft Edge normally is updated through build updates, which are received through Windows update. I know it sounds kind of confusing, but it makes sense if you think about it to the next version of Windows as Microsoft Edge updates are typically bundled with version upgrades in Windows 10. So it's a pretty automated process, but if the updates are not automatically running for you, check for updates and then it'll begin the process of downloading and installing updates. So once this is done, I will be right back. Hello everyone, I'm back. So the updates finished downloading. I scheduled the computer to restart, so and once the computer is done restarting, I will be right back. Hello everyone, I'm back. So if we open up our Microsoft Edge browser, and again like we did before, I'm going to go under settings. We are currently on build 25.10586, the latest build of Microsoft Edge. Now I do want to note that this method by going through the Windows updates can take quite a while if you have Windows updates that are outstanding and need to be installed. So just keep that in mind. So while you're updating your Microsoft Edge browser, you're also going to be updating your Windows system as well. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.